So joining me on Fan TV after a 7-1 home victory against the London Raiders, I've got uh, Will Weldon and, and, uh, and Rob Ferrara. Will, that, that's got to be as complete a performance as we've seen for, for a long while. Yeah, definitely. We, we started well, um, which we didn't do yesterday. Um, and then we had a, a followed it up with a good second period. And then in the third period, it was obviously a, a bit more broken. Um, but we were playing our fourth line every other shift. And, you know, you've got young guys there getting valuable ice time. And I think that just adds to, adds to it. And Rob, I think uh, the importance of special teams is, is really exemplified in that game. So in the first period, we killed two penalties and then scored on power play ourselves and then scored power play late on. Yeah, definitely. Special teams are always important every game. Um, if you get that opportunity um, with a man advantage, you need to take it, at least a couple in a game. So, yeah, it, it proved again tonight. Um, and obviously the PK did well to, to shut them down. And uh, I think really, uh, from, from certainly from the home games perspective, I'm not sure there's been an awful lot wrong in the last couple of games, but we've had three, t three, three, two defeats. And uh, although one was overtime, one was uh, a shootout. Uh, I wondered what the uh, the feeling would be like coming against the hottest team in the league, but the, the 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 answer to that question was was evident through the first period. Yeah, obviously it is a results business, so we we do care what the result is, but. The, the panic starts when the performance isn't there and over the, over those run of fixtures where we have uh, dropped points the, the performance has still been there and I think um, on other nights we would probably come away with, with victories so we've not panicked at all, we knew that if we kept playing the way we would uh, a scoreline like tonight was just a matter of time. And, and Robbie, I think uh, uh, it's often the case that the goal scorers get the, the plaudits, uh, the netminders sometimes get them for, for shutout but uh, this team that we've had here tonight have, have been scoring for fun themselves. They've, they've, they've beaten Basingstoke, they've beaten uh, Bratnell and Swindon twice. So defensively from front to back, I think we've done really well. Yeah, I think as as a complete team, we've, we've done really well. We've shut them down well. Um, we sort of, Slav went through a few of their plays that he think they may do and I think they came up and we, we coped with them quite well. Um, but I think the, the sort of tough run we've had where we've had a few losses, we still only let in two goals each game and then I'll see the late one in Swindon for the third, which is really good. We've played the top teams and we're only letting in maybe two goals a game. Is It's really where you want to be. So I think defensively, as a, as a unit, as a full team, we've, we've done really, really well. I think uh, we've talked before about the key to playing some of those top teams is to split the series, minimally split the series. And I, I think we, we, we're doing reasonably well on, on those things. And, and, and of course, uh, though we fell in overtime, I think, early in the season against the London Raiders here, we've beaten them now three consecutive times. It starts to, to build momentum, doesn't it, Will? Yeah, that's it. Obviously, as I say, the, the results is, is the bottom line. Why, why we play the game? We, we play to win. We play to try and get silverware. And the fact that we're, we're putting ourselves in a good position in every series, series we're playing at the minute, obviously, is a testament to the way we're playing. And I think the, the plan is that we just continue doing that, take it the old cliche one game at a time but that's that is what we're doing and it's it's working for us so we'll, we'll keep doing that and hopefully um, we'll be in the mix come the end of the year well done tonight I think it's a real marker a real testament that result and it's a double header against Milton Keynes next weekend home on Saturday away on Sunday we'll see you then